here today on Capitol Hill to improve accessible air travel for people with disabilities. The airlines are the only mode of transportation that are not ADA accessible and that is unacceptable. The fear is boarding a plane. For muscular dystrophy patients, they have to get out of their wheelchair and be transferred by someone that they don't even know into an aisle seat and then into another seat that doesn't even fit their needs. For many of us, it, it's a health issue. It's not just being uncomfortable. The fear is getting out of this chair and handing this chair over to someone else. The well-intentioned people that are loading the luggage are not ever trained on how to take apart a wheelchair and they're all dismantled in a different way. Recently coming up to DC they had my wheelchair upside down and it's actually damaged. The flight attendant on the plane actually said to me, it's just a wheelchair, stop crying, what is the big deal? A wheelchair is not just a wheelchair, a piece of equipment, it's our mobility and it's our legs. This is my body and my independence that I live in every day and the anxiety is really incredible and scary during flights because until I have my wheelchair intact and in my possession again, it's really traumatic and hard to just experience. Very big need for everyone to know that although we're in these chairs, we can still travel, we can still move, we can still talk, we can still work, we can still do a lot of things that everybody else does, we just use chairs. I think it's extremely important to speak for yourself and fight for your rights. Speak out. Don't be afraid to tell your story. The time has come for airlines to join the rest of the travel industries in making air travel inclusive for all.